APC Tinubu holding new Naira note for vote buying, PDP alleges. Wow. The All Progressive Congress APC and its presidential candidate Bola Tinubu have been accused of holding the new Naira redesigned, newly redesigned Naira note for vote buying in the forthcoming elections. Now it was reported that the opposition People's Democratic Party PDP made the accusation in a statement issued on Sunday by East National Publicity Secretary Debo Ologunagba. Okay. The PDP condemned the excruciating pain and distress being faced by Nigerians arising from their inability to assess the new Nara notes occasioned by the reported nefarious activities of the corrupt APC leaders who are compromising the system. Can you imagine? It is said the pain, suffering, and hardship brought upon the country by the APC will be forgotten when the PDP flag bearer Atiku Abubakar becomes president on May 29. The opposition party called on the Central Bank of Nigeria to be mindful of the suffering being experienced daily by Nigerians. It also asked banks to take urgent measures to arrest the situation by ensuring adequate protection and effective monitoring of cash distribution progress or process. The statement reads, the People's Democratic Party, PDP, expresses optimism that the hopelessness and anguish brought upon our nation by the All Progressive Congress APC administration will be a thing of the past when the PDP presidential candidate Atiku Abubakar assumes office as president come May 29, 2023. The PDP decries the excruciating pain and distress being faced by Nigerians arising from their inability to assess the new Naira notes occasioned by the reported nefarious activities of corrupt APC leaders who are compromising the system to intercept and hold the new Naira banknotes for their selfish vote buying plans ahead of the February 25, 2023 presidential elections. Oh boy. So our party is, however, saddened that the clash, sorry, the cash crunch had persisted due to the sabotage of the corrupt APC leaders, including the APC presidential candidate, Asiwaji Volatinubu, all right, who are alleged to have masterminded the intercepting and hoarding of the new notes for their selfish agenda. The PDP said Nigerians now, Nigerians know that Tinubu and APC are responsible for the anguish they are currently being subjected to as a result of the scarcity of the new Naira note and will deal with them in the forthcoming election. It, however, asked President Buhari, Muhammad Buhari, to go after corrupt APC leaders and saboteurs in the system who are reportedly working with Tinubu to mop up cash for vote buying. Can you imagine? It added, Nigerians now know the truth and hold Ashiwaju Tinubu and the APC directly responsible for the anguish they have been subjected to in the face of this excruciating cash scarcity. Another reason why, another reason they will deal um, with Tinubu a humiliating blow with their votes at the February, 20, February presidential election. So that is the reason. The PDP calls on President Buhari to protect Nigerians by going after these felonious APC leaders as well as the saboteurs in the system who are reportedly working for the APC presidential campaign to mop up cash meant for distribution to our citizens. Our party stands with Nigerians, the artisans, traders, drivers, keke and okada riders, laborers, food vendors, students and all hardworking citizens at this time of distress. Hmm. So can you imagine what uh, um, what uh, PDP is writing here that Tinubu and uh, APC they are responsible for the scarcity of the new Nara note because they have intercepted it and want to use it for the uh, forthcoming election purposely for vote buying. So Debo Ologunagba is the person here that is accusing uh, APC and Tinubu on behalf of PDP that they know what is happening, they know what they're doing, they intercepted the Naira and then kept it for themselves for the purpose of vote buying. 
thereby throwing Nigeria into serious hardship, into serious penury at this moment. No money to do anything. Nigerians can't assess the money they have in their bank. And then, <laughs> leading to excruciating pain um, um, upon the Nigerian citizens. This is actually very bad and becoming unbearable. I think they should get ready because what is coming might be too difficult for them to manage. What is coming, they don't solve this first scarcity and another scarcity that is going on in Nigeria today. What is coming, they might not be able to contain it. Uh, somebody was saying this morning that NSAS part 2 is loaded. Okay? And by the time it's going to break out, it's going to be worse than the NSAS part 1 that happened in October 2020. And it will be difficult to manage. Very, very difficult to manage. Okay? No matter the number of security forces that are going to bring out to quell that dem demonstration or revolution, <laughs> I wonder how many people they will kill because uh, almost everybody is going to come out for that protest. So that is the state of Nigeria at this moment. Um, Debo Ologunagba is telling the whole world that PDP, sorry, APC and Tinubu are responsible for holding this new Naira note. I think I also saw um, a, a, a news talking about how Tinubu's 22.5 uh, billion Naira or so uh, is intercepted at uh, the north, I think around Kano. Okay, so so the problem I have is that when Asu was on strike, nobody was talking. When things were going haywire, nobody was talking in this country. Okay, but now that the MFL is talking about Naira, everybody is, they are shouting because that this one is affecting them now. The money they have stashed for vote buying, they can't move it. They don't even know what to do with it. As you speak, they are confused. Very, very confused people. Okay. Very, very confused people. Now, you did not shout when those critical times were there. Now, that because the Naira thing is affecting everybody, now they are shouting. Which is very, 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 very bad. That is very, very, very bad for, for Nigerian populace. So, Tinubu, I'm sure APC will read this and will try to respond to it as well. To clear their name that they are not responsible. But who will believe them? That are not responsible because the way they are, they, the confidence that is playing is that <laughs> no matter what happens, they will win the election because they think they have the structure, they have the resources and material to win the election. Okay, but the question is the people that are following APC now, will they all vote APC, especially at presidential level, or are they just following APC because of the money they are going to get or the one that they are getting already? Okay, if you look at the people following them, following the APC and Tinubu, you see that they are even tired of following them. They just don't know what to do. Right? When all of those uh, 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 campaign errors are being made, you will see them cringing to themselves like the edge will open, let them enter. Right? So the fact here is that APC and Tinubu need to prove to Nigerians that they are not holding the Naira and they are not responsible for the scarcity. And they are responsible people uh, as individual as individual cities of Nigeria. Okay. And hopefully people that are wishing to lead Nigeria uh, uh, from this party. So that is the state of the country right now, the state of what the PDP is claiming or alleging, um, putting the scarcity of the new Nara note on Tinubu and APC.